Hello, I'm Brian Fitzgerald, the Golf Doctor, and today I'm going to show you a game you can play with pitching that's really going to help lower your score. Stay tuned. So what is this game that I'm going to teach you today? Uh, it's pretty easy. I've set up a circle which is three feet in circumference or one putter length in diameter I should say and around that I've set up some cones around that and each cone is about four paces from the edge and I'm standing here at about 20 yards away 25 yards away something like that and what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and attempt to hit a pitch shot that goes into that circle initially if it goes into the circle I'm going to give myself a score of a birdie I'm not going to putt today I'm just going to assume anything that finishes in that uh, three foot radius circle is going to be a one putt if I finish inside the cones that's going to give me a par I'm going to automatically give myself two putts and if I finish outside of the cones I'm going to make sure that I give myself a bogey so I have nine balls here and I'm gonna see what score I can generate with that. I'm gonna hopefully have nine pars or even better. Now, because I've, uh, this is just me and the cameras here today, I haven't got time to set up nine different locations, but I've gotta say my preference for this is to have these nine balls situated in different spots around the green. You could even do it in a bunker, but it, it really is important that you do vary it because we want to try and make practice feel like it's a game of golf. Having nine balls down here in front of me, hitting nine balls in a row, isn't really real golf. So it's a, it's a version of practice, but we want to practice like we play. So the best alternative is definitely nine balls totally around the green in all sides, and then we're trying to set ourselves a goal. So I won't hit all nine shots, but I'll hit a shot and we'll see how we go with it. I also think it's important when we do this to make sure that we go through our pre-shot routine. We just don't go on autopilot and just hit nine shots. That's why it's good to walk around and get the, get the different positions, take your bag with you, select the club. But we're gonna make it as real as possible. So we go through the pre-shot routine. So I'm gonna enter that now. Of course, I have my little rehearsal. Try and feel the club. and then I hit the shot. I actually hit a pretty good shot, but the green's very wet, slightly uphill, and I think I finished outside the circle there. I think I'm about 30 centimeters out. So that would count as a bogey. So as I said before, we would hopefully go to a different location. Uh, I'm gonna have another go from here now. Once again, pre-shot routine. And of course it's not wet up there, so I've hit that a little bit long. I'm, I've paid the penalty of trying to overdo the first one, so that's another bogey. So now I'm two over par. So if my goal was to finish at even par, somewhere I've got to make some birdies. I'll hit one more. I've obviously been spending far too much time on the bike and not enough time on my short game. So it doesn't matter what I do, the purpose is that you try and rehearse and you practice to improve your golf. I really like doing this skill. Uh, especially as I said in the different locations because if you set the bar at even par or you might even set it at two over or three over par depending on what your handicap is you're going to start feeling pressure the, the more balls you hit and you're going to think I really want to achieve my goal so we're going to try and make it as real as we can and I think this is a really good test of your golf abilities so uh, I hope you've enjoyed it do it on a regular basis do it once a week count your score write it in the notes function of your phone and that becomes your PB and you just keep doing it over a period of weeks and it will get much, much better. And if you can tidy this area up, it will definitely lower your score. Thank you for letting me help you with your golf. I'm Brian Fitzgerald, 
the Golf Doctor. And if you like my videos, you, you can subscribe by hitting the round avatar down the bottom there, or you can get further information on my Facebook page or my Twitter feed, or you can also sign up to my electronic newsletter at thegolfdoctor.com.au.